Hi, I'm Krista with the Big Family Homestead, and today we are going to be making, or I should say I'm going to be making, a traditional family recipe, arroz con pollo, or to our friends in the United States, chicken with rice. We absolutely love Latin flavors. And this particular recipe is one of our favorites. It's fast, it's easy, it's healthy for you, and it's delicious. Let's check out the ingredients and let's get cooking. Now for the ingredients, they're super, super basic. I even have my list so I don't forget anything, which makes Brad really happy. We have six chicken thighs seasoned with salt and pepper. We have a cup and a half of green peas. We have four cups of chicken broth. Three heaping tablespoons of sasson, which is equal parts of cumin, coriander, paprika, garlic, and salt. We have about a quarter of a cup of cilantro. We have a cup of Thrive onions, which is equivalent to one whole onion. We have one cup of mixed bell peppers, which equals one bell pepper, a quarter cup of tomato sauce, a couple of tablespoons of garlic, two small chopped tomatoes, and two cups of uncooked rice. Now these are not essential ingredients, however, we really like to have these along with this recipe. So some sour cream and some Cholula, our favorite hot sauce. A lot of flavor, not a lot of heat. First things first, we're gonna go ahead and put a little oil in our pan and turn it up to a medium high heat. Next up, we're gonna put about half of our chicken in here and get that browning, scoot that off to the side and then add the rest of our chicken and get that all browned up. thing is you don't need to cook this chicken all the way through because it's going to continue cooking when you add the rest of the ingredients so if you just get it brown on the outside then you're golden all right let's give this baby a stir get this chicken over to one side so we can go ahead and put our peppers and onions and garlic in there oh man this is smelling yummy Oh yeah. Next up, our tomatoes go in. Give that a stir, oh boy. This is smelling so yummy. Now we're gonna go ahead and incorporate our chicken. And once again, it's okay if some of the chicken is not fully cooked because it's gonna simmer in the broth for 20 minutes. Next goes in the tomato sauce and our sasson. Ooh, yummy, look at that. Now we're gonna add our chicken broth, our peas and our rice and bring this to a boil. You may wonder why our peas are floating. It's because they're freeze-dried peas. You know we love our Thrive Life. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and add our cilantro in. Get this all stirred up. We're gonna bring it to a simmer, put a top on, and let it simmer for 20 minutes. Now while this is simmering, let me show you how I made tomato sauce out of our Thrive Life tomato powder. I take a half a cup of water and I put it in a bowl. Then I take two tablespoons of Thrive powder, sorry, tomato powder, and mix that together. 
and it makes the perfect consistency for tomato sauce. If you want tomato paste, add less water. So we've waited our time and it is finished. Look at that. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh. I wish you guys had smell-o-vision because let me tell you, this smells ridiculous. Feast your eyes upon this delight of delights, yumminess of yumminess. I cannot wait to taste this. Oh, piece of chicken and some peas. I know those are Brad's favorite. Mm. There's so much flavor there. It's so good. So good. The sour cream just makes it nice and creamy and then the Cholula gives it so much more of a flavor. Oh my goodness. So bold, delicious, easy, fast, good for you. I mean, it's there's no processed junk in here. It is so good for you. Arroz con pollo, chicken with rice. I hope you make some soon. Your family will love it. I'm Krista with the Big Family Homestead and you have an amazing day.